Hello to everyone, I'm Indurak and today I'm playing more Chromatos. So this sure is taking a while to beat or to get to the end of. Did you want to talk to me or? Can I rest here? Sure, that's, I mean, okay. Ah, yay, my state of mind is all right. Let's unwind. What? What exactly do you? Oh, are you talking? I would like that, but shouldn't we at least get rescued first? Okay. Let's look for help. Should I follow you to the chamber then? I, I, I guess I should probably go to other floors. I mean, I don't know. I don't know what's correct to do here. Hmm. Okay. Am I in batch? Okay. Oh, as long as I'm a uh, is uh, if I'm like here, like my uh my uh my state of mind would be fine, right? So exactly how much of this can I do? All right, this is my area, right? I'm pretty sure. Yeah, this is my area. I don't think I need to be here anymore. But I mean, I don't know. Hmm. So what should I go to next? Uh, let's go here. Hmm. <coughs> oh, it's a, it's a party room here. Whose is this? Oh, uh, what the prima donna? <laughs> Repeated long-term trauma resulting in cerebrovascular and subdermal hematoma. I'm I'm sorry, I'm not a doctor. I can't read this shit. Very poor prognosis. Complete recovery unlikely. Pain medication strongly recommended. Okay then. Whoa, what? Whoa. Holy shit, this is a lot of people. Wait. Hang on. Are these really people? I'm pretty sure they're not. I can't tell if they're some kind of illusion or if they're just ignoring me. They don't seem to be reaching out to me at all. Well, where there's smoke, there's fire. Something must be going on past here. Obviously. Hello. Turn around and walk away, glasses. Shit. I was really hoping that security guard was one of them. No one goes in. She doesn't take visitors. If I want in there, I better think fast. Oh, well, I really need to see her. Yeah, that's gonna work. Do you now? How many times do you think I've heard that line? I'm not paparazzi. 
Oh, neither are any of these upstanding citizens. Yeah, right. Really, dude. This isn't going anywhere. Yeah! Wait, I have an idea. Please work, please work. Look, I'm just doing my job, same as you. What's that supposed to mean? See this arm band? I'm EM I'm an EMT. Uh-huh. They didn't give me any details, they just told me someone needed medical attention on this floor. I didn't hear anything about that. Search me if you want. I'm not armed. I don't have a camera. If she's injured, we're wasting precious time. F fine, just go in. I hear anything I don't like, they'll have to scrape you off the ground once I'm done with you. Well, here goes. Mm -hmm. So I wonder what the real name of that, of this person is. Ugh, what a smell. No doubt about it, this is a locker room. <laughs> I haven't been in one like this in a while, though. I'm surprised you remember that much. It definitely doesn't look like the staff ones at the hospital. Well, yeah. Is that blood? It certainly looks like it. Oh shit, there's blood on the floor. Dried, not fresh. Who? What's with the who? This is off, it's awfully quiet. Is she not here? No way that guard was protecting an empty room. <laughs> Whoa, jeez, holy shit. Thought, thought you got the fucking drop on me, huh? Ow, ow. What? Who is this? This is bad. Oh, wait, what? I have no idea what just happened, but that was not supposed to happen. Didn't I tell you freaks you'd never kill me? This woman is bleeding, but she doesn't seem scared. Actually, she seems excited. I've never seen someone so roughed up look so alive. Hang on. Five, ten, twenty, I don't give a fuck. Entertain me, you creeping bat, you creepy bastards. For real though, you barely even look worth it, little dude. I'm not a I'm not a monster, I'm not! Sounds like some shit a monster would say. I know the way out. I came looking for other trapped people. You know the way out? You mean out of here? Yeah, I do. I think. You should have said something sooner, dumbass. Somebody could have gotten hurt. Okay, well at least she's... At least she's not a completely crazy psycho. Who just... Who... Okay. At least she believes me, at least. I did get hurt. <laughs> I thought you were another one of those creepy fuckers that keep coming after me. By the way, in case you really are... Just in case you really are one of them and hoping to sneak up on me, don't even fucking think about it. Don't let this eye patch fool you. I ain't got no blind sides. You jumped me before I could say anything. My mistake. She doesn't seem like a bad person, just intense. What's your name, dude? Well, that was fast. She was talking about killing me 30 seconds ago and now she's smiling. I guess she's decided I'm no threat. I'll try not to let that hurt my pride. Leroy, and yours? Call me P. Just P? Is that short for something? Obviously. Prima Donna? Oh. <laughs> well. Prima Donna. Seriously. Is that her real name? No! You saw, uh, you saw the chart, right? If you laugh at her, you're dead, Leroy. Don't you do it. I... I see. P it is. I don't know about anyone else being in here with me. Except those monsters, obviously. Not like I know why they're here, either. I mean... I got these words in my head. Don't know where I heard them, but I just do. What do you mean? Well, 
I ain't sure. For example, I know I'm a fighter and I know that I'm the best. Right, Mom. But I don't know why I'm here. I don't really believe in all that afterlife stuff, but I'm kind of wondering. Is this hell then? You and me, are we dead? Good question. I mean, according to Izzy, we're comatose. But why is there an alternate world full of the comatose? I mean, thinking about it, didn't someone out didn't someone have to create this world? Yeah, I still kind of don't trust Izzy, but I mean, why create it? Why put us in it? I can't wrap my head around it. Mainly because my head's not very good at wrapping around things. It's just a one round clump of meat or well, and bones. There's no way I can give P the answer she's seeking, so I give her the best one I can. We're not dead. At least I'm pretty sure we're not dead. How do you know? Remember how I said I know the way out? Yeah. Well, I met someone who knows a lot about this world, and she said that all of us here are in comas. Therefore, we're not dead. Yet. Coma? That sounds bad. How do you figure I ended up here, then? Now that, I can't tell you. Sorry, P. Let me get this straight. All we gotta do is get out of here. All we gotta do is get out of here somehow. And I'll wake up, then. So I'm told. Something about passing a test and reversing what put you in a coma in the first place. Well, shit. I got it all figured out, then. I think this all adds up. After my last match in here, the announcer said, I only gotta win four more fights, then it's all over. Four more fights? Yeah, then I'm probably free to go. Think about it. I'm a pro fighter that ended up in the coma, right? I bet you a nickel if it's because I lost a match. So all I gotta do is undo my loss by winning my fights here. I mean... That makes sense, I guess, but that almost sounds too simple. Why would this elaborate coma world be built just so P could get a rematch? What type of fights are we talking about here? Looking at the shape she's in, I kinda... I can kinda answer the question for myself. <laughs> I ain't seen anything like it before. They're people, but they ain't people. More of those creatures I've been fighting, maybe. Is that what you meant by monsters? Yeah. I figure you can't be one of them, after all. They don't have names. Of course. I guess I never let them tell me if they did. Ah, well. Okay. I fought them before. Let me help. You? Fight? Oh, man, you're a fucking riot. I'm serious. Let me help you fight. Two's better than one, right? I'm sorry, man. I just... You look about as sturdy as the specks on your face. You done? Yeah. Yeah, I'm done. Pfft. You really know how to fight these things? How do you think I got here? On a red carpet? Good point. But it doesn't matter. Prima Donna fights alone. For fuck's sake, P. The sooner you win, the sooner you leave. Just say yes already. You really want this, huh? No, I just have the feeling you're gonna die if I don't help. Not that I'm telling you that. If this were the if this were the real world, no fucking way I'd let you th you do this without signing a bunch of waivers and shit. Papers saying your family can't sue if you drop dead. I guess it's your lucky day. I hate signing papers. Okay. That's good, I think. Really quick question, though. You're bleeding, you know. Oh. I guess I am. I didn't really notice, honestly. It's just a scratch. Does P not feel pain? How does she... How can she be so nonchalant about this? Time to make myself useful. I was an EMT, after all. I gotta remember at least something as simple as this. 
Well, humor me. At least let me patch you up. I can do it myself, man. I can do it myself, man. Really, it's a lot easier if someone does it for you. Just let me find some stuff to work with. I suppose. I think I saw a first aid kit here around here somewhere. No idea if it's got anything left in it, though. You happen to remember where you saw that first aid kit? Uh, locker number 57. No, 75. Fuck. One of those. It's a maze back there. I'll check both. Thanks. Nah, don't thank me. You're the one helping me out. Right. Well, I guess. Okay, well, I'm gonna end my video here, so... Boop. There's no way I played for that long. I don't know what's up with the timing on this thing. Anyway, I gotta end my video, so that's the end of this video, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.